डॉक्टर विकास महत में लेस देन टेन मिनट्स थैंक यू सर ऑनरेबल डेप्यूटी चेयरमैन सर आई शैल लाइक टू थैंक एंड कॉन्ग्रेचुलेट ऑनरेबल हेल्थ मिनिस्टर फ्रॉम फॉर ब्रिंगिंग इन दिस बेल विच वॉज लॉन्ग अवेटेड एंड इट हैज सर्टन फीचर्स विच आई फील वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट वन इज दैट it prevents the spread of the disease and this is very important because they, as on today there is no curative treatment for hiv whatever we are treating is reducing the dose of the virus in the blood circulation so the prevention of the disease is the most important part and that will be taken care by this bill is the most important thing which i feel secondly those who are suffering from the <coughs> disease should get the health services should be accessible and should be available at affordable cost this should include the counseling this should include the uh, other parts of the medical management also support and other part and that is provided by this bill this is a provision for this counseling and other medical facilities that is also a good part of this bill there is a provision to protect the rights of the patient suffering from hiv and aids and we know that these patients are discriminated there is a social stigma around that and uh, nobody wants to give a house uh, a rented house for these people and they, nobody wants to give admission in the schools so all this will be taken care by the legal way and to have a speedy legal uh, the speedy result ombudsman will be appointed it, uh, in one state there can be one or more ombudsman also as uh, the honorable member has uh, suggested and uh, this bill also suggests that there can be more more than one ombudsman in one state uh, what uh, about the ombudsman <laughs> i personally feel that there is a big problem that uh, uh, very few medical health professionals are working in this field that is hiv i and i feel only two or three are registered medical practitioner as specialized in hiv so these people many of these people which i already honorable member has told may have criminal background so these medical professionals may be exploited by the hiv patient themselves for their own sake so from ombudsman uh, regular uh, re regulations i personally feel medical health provisions can be taken out but they by routine legal procedures they can be prosecuted because as you know nobody today wants to work in this field and we have very very few medical health professionals working in this field so that th i think that should be amend amendment should be, uh, the, uh, suggestion is there uh for all this treatment and avoiding social stigma confidentiality is very important in all those hospitals in which hiv test is done what happens nobody tells the what patient this? that this test is done and when the result come out result may rarely come out wrongly also as hiv positive and then it creates a big shock for the family and the patient but this bill covers that informed consent will be required for all those states which are required to assess the hiv status so that is also very important thing which is done by this bill so i support this bill but i have a uh, few more suggestions one of the suggestion was that the as far as possible uh, word should be taken out from clause 15 but i personally feel but i don't agree with that because i tell you the i told that Uh, the treatment for retrovirus for, for this is very very costly and uh, you cannot say that it, whatever is feasible then once it is feasible means economically it is feasible then we will have to pay a huge cost for treating these patients and there is no cure for this so unnecessarily the diseases which can be treated easily and have fully cured the amount has been will be withdrawn from those patients and will be given to this part that has to be understood and i personally feel it should be at affordable cost and as far as possible only then the uh, about the truck drivers it was stated that they are infected bone that is true 
but day by day the uh, chances of infections are becoming less and less because the awareness uh, has increased and that is shown by the statistics also so i personally feel that in awareness among the truck drivers should be raised definitely and that is very important uh, uh, one more was there for the security persons it was stated that they will not be given the jobs of the security person by the home department i personally feel and it is right that wherever the person gets the chances there are more chances of injuries like in security this is patient should not be uh, exposed to those jobs because then it will be very difficult to treat these patients because their immunity is very low so they will succumb and they may die because of those injuries so it is better to avoid on the medical grounds the jobs uh, not so security can be an, uh, can be uh, can be exempted from that that they may not be given the job for the security that was the only thing but i fully support this bill and i congratulate okay. the health minister thank you thank you very much thank you